I paid $2.48 for this module. And what is it? It's a two-channel digital audio power amplifier board, stereo, 30 watts per channel module for MP3. The model is HW404. Alright, and it looks very cool with that blue heatsink. I wait two weeks for this and I got it. Oh, bubbles. Besides, the, I love to pop them up. They are good protection for the product. In this case, this awesome small PCB board, amplifier board. Oh, beautiful. Let's see the specification. It says input voltage from 8 to 26 volts. Amplifier type class D. Number of channels, dual channels, output power 15 watts plus 15 watts. That means that I'm wrong. At the beginning of the video, I said that is. 30 watts per channel, no. 30 watts is the total power, 15 watts per channel, output impedance, it says 4 to 8 ohms. Alright, and the model's module size is 43 by 55 by 14 millimeters, and the package weight 21 grams. Alright, let's take a closer look of this beautiful PCB board. The heatsink is not in the center, but I can't do nothing about that. Okay, we have audio input right here. On this point, you're gonna solder the positive and negative power supply for the audio amplifier, and from the other side, we have left and right output points. Nothing more. Oh, we have a LED for indicating that the module is powered up. Alright, let's hook up everything, speakers and power, and test it. Before I show you how it sounds this module, the sponsor of this video is JLC PCB. Take your electronic project to the next level with JLC PCB, a global leader in high quality, low cost PCB manufacturing and assembly. Whether you are a beginner, hobbyist or professional engineer, JLC PCB makes it easy to run your ideas into reality. Get high precision PCB starting from just $2 and rapid 24 hour turnaround and global shipping. Choose from wide range of board types, layer options, colors and finishes to suit any project need. Reliable, affordable and fast, JLC PCB is your one stop PCB solution. Visit jlcpcb.com and bring your circuit design to life. All wires are now connected. I have left and right speaker. These speakers I bought from local flea market. I don't know from where they are pulled out, maybe from car or old TV. Here it is the amplifier module 2 times by 15 watts class D. Here I have a small module which is Bluetooth audio receiver that will receive the, the song from my smartphone and through the 3.5 millimeter jack will be audio input for the amplifier. I will set the power voltage 12 volts. Some of you, I don't know who, comment that I need to use for positive and for negative wires different sizes or lengths. And here it is, the positive is short, the blue is longer. Now I'm gonna connect 12 volts to the power amplifier. And yes, 
it's working. I have a blue light on the amplifier. Now we'll play some music. Okay, connected with the amplifier through the Bluetooth audio receiver and play. Tell me in the comments what you think, how it sounds, is it good or is, is it bad? By the way, these speakers are very cheap. I think it's pretty clear. turning off the Bluetooth receiver so you, you can see that this is not a fake power on again Bluetooth mode Bluetooth mode at 12 volts the amplifier is pulling around 150 milliampers, maximum 200 milliampers. I don't know, did you hear me? Also to mention that the audio chip, integrated chip on the PCB board is TPA3116D2, 2 times by 15 watts. Alright, that was all for today's demonstration of this chip audio amplifier i hope you like it please give a like share and subscribe to my channel see ya